So putting a stream of particles through two slits, we wouldn't see an interference pattern. We just would have got a smeared image from the two slits all mushed on top of each other. And if we put a wave through two slits, we do see an interference pattern. So Young used this to show that light was a wave. But you can also use this to tell whether other things are a wave or not. For example, you might be able to get an electron gun out of a really old television and fire them through two slits, and then you find out whether electrons are particles or waves. Now I'm going to show you a movie of someone who's done exactly that with electrons soon, but first, I want you to answer a very simple question. If you turn down the intensity of those electrons, so if you turn down your electron gun that you pulled out of an old television, and you get a very small number of electrons landing on your screen, what is that going to look like? 